Hi, it's the camera, so welcome back to some more Persona 5 for, uh, In the last episode, we reunited with Shido, and now our plan to steal Shido's heart is about to begin. We're gonna play a game, let's start. Train of Life! Okay. Let's start our Train of Life. Yeah! Okay. Let's start the intermediate course. It seems like things are going well for the time being. Let's just hope it stays that way. Oh. Wait, something's coming out of the ground. Could it be? Snap, snap, snap. I'm the alligator who watches over this gate. Hence why they call me the alligator. Give me a number to open the gate. Snap. I'll give you three chances. Snap. There it is, the alligator. Don't lose to it this time. So the numbers that open this lock are three, five, seven, nine. Roll two dice and make sure they add up to one of those two numbers. Snap. I'll give you three chances. Snap. Time for the full first roll. Three, five, seven, nine. Two. That's not one of my numbers. It's adding up to evens. That's not even fair. Five. Oh, you rolled a five. You, you're impressive, Snap. I'll let you through, Snap. Oh, the gate's opening. All right, let's head onward to the goal. Finally! Hey. We made it to the finish line in first place. What a battle. My paws are all sweaty. Well, it seems you'll learn how to keep your heart open even in the face of brutally unfair requests. <laughs> yeah! More kindness! Thank you. Yeah. Well, it's starting to get late. Let's head to bed soon, okay? Yes. We have big day. Seems like there'll be a, there'll be a higher voter turnout at this election. This will totally be an easy win for Shido. He's really got the famous all from all that Phantom Thieves business. He's on track to become prime minister. Guess I should be on Shido's side. No, you should be on our side. Kid had it coming, lol. He got what he deserved. Fuck you all. I've actually been pr paying attention to the news lately. Aren't you proud of me? Don't you leave it on hope. Don't you leave it on hoping that I catch you will be there? Well, not that I blame you. He's a real hero. I think Masayu Shishido is even more amazing, though. He's the first politician I've ever believed in. Oh, I know. Shiro's son, too. It sounds like he really wants to improve the country. Can't they see they're being lied to? We have to do something. And we will. We will. Oh my god. The fan thieves have been on the news recently, so I was wondering how you're doing. Are you going to give up without accomplishing your goal? No problems here. So you're okay. That's a relief. I'm expecting great things from the fan thieves. If you need anything, I'm happy to help my comrade. I love Yoshida so much, she's so cool. Feels pretty weird seeing you around on a weekday. You're taking off tonight, right? Sheesh, you're such a risk taker. Listen, make sure nobody knows you, okay? God, we have to do something about the keyword for this, for sure this time. We will. Security guards became suspicious of us last time, so we can't stay here for long. We still have no hit. Think it's a barrier after all? Where'd your enthusiasm from yesterday go? Ah, shut up. The real game starts at two outs. Enough chatting. You should only be thinking about the keyword. The citizens are secondary. He only cares about his own well-being and that of his lackeys. He wants to become prime minister, even if it means trampling on others. Fortune, rich people. Hey, can you think of anything based on what you've heard from him? Just try saying anything. It doesn't matter if you guess. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. Steer? Is it a ship? It was a match? What? The diet building's a ship? What kind of scenery will that be? The actual building? 
things on land. I can't even begin to imagine what it will be like. Well, whatever it is, looks like there are no barriers. Oh, sh shut up! Let's hurry up and go in. Are we clear of the guard's sight? Get closer to the wall, just in case. All right, do it. I love how they didn't move at all. They didn't move at all closer to the wall. They just, they just sat in the same place, stood in the same place. Whatever. Did anything change? We went in, right? Security guards seem to be gone, but it's difficult to tell for certain. This seems to be similar to what happened with Sis's palace. But this time, the Dyad building remains unchanged. Uh, the gate wasn't opened earlier, though. Wait, look! Mona's appearance is different. That means we're definitely in a palace. Come on, let's go take a look. How's it look over there? See anything? No, nah, totally normal. I'll check it out. Huh? What the heck? What's up, Futaba? <laughs> Futaba? What is it? Clothes aren't changing, I guess he don't see us as a threat yet, huh? Speaking of that, shouldn't Red have been disguising himself on the way here? Uh, seeing someone in disguise with a bunch of kids in school uniforms would have been super, would be super weird. We won't have to worry about any of that once we steal the treasure. Let's do this! Let's head on in. Oh, wait. Okay. We only have three people for some reason. Ryuji. Joker. I'm ready whenever you need me. Put me in, coach. I'm counting on you. Yeah. You can count on me. Okay, let's go. Masayoshi Shio's palace. Wonder what waits us within. Let's go find out. It's time we begin our own infiltration. I understand why you might already see us as a threat, but why are even the passengers wearing masks? Uh, you think they're trying to be fan of these like Noir was with that beauty thief stuff? <laughs> that, that's quite enough! It looks like. Whatever the reason, it reflects Shiro's mentality. Surely he doesn't view others normally. You're right. Given the insane nature of his distortion, I'm surprised they even look like people. It's very likely we'll end up in battles from here forward. Be on your guard, everyone. 
Who are you? Don't you think you could... Don't think you could talk to an honored guest of Mr. Shida so casually. One odd costume. Is that what you young people are into nowadays? Choke an enemy! Uh, it's attacking us with all these people around? Web Cerberus. No, they aren't. They're still alive. Hell yeah. Oh, is this a show of sorts? Mr. Shido never fails to keep his guests entertained. Indeed, those privileged enough to be on this ship are all on the winning team. What is with these people? Why do they not feel any danger after what they just witnessed? It seems they think no harm will come to them because they're here on Shido's ship. They're not even sensing the danger. Come on, let's make them see what this ship really is. Alright. Oh God. Employer, please spare my life. Join my cause. I love conversations such as this. Oh, I'm sorry, I remember now. It's... I am not shy. I originate from the human sea of souls. My true name is Sarabat. Saras body. Henceforth, I am that. Sweet new persona. Chest up here that I want to try and that I want to get. Ah, I'm 
pressing the wrong buttons constantly. Treasure chest. Why don't we open it? That's literally why we're up here. Test the church's presence. It's that way. Let's go, guys. Of course. These huge doors are obviously suspicious. I wonder what's through here. There are slots to stick in something like a key card. Oh, there's five of them. usually seen on the news. Oh, that thing! Gotcha! So, what are they doing inside? Most likely a meaningless vote. One in which whatever Shido proposes will always go unopposed. So he's doing whatever he wants by keeping only his supporters in there. What do we do to get in, though? Should we find these key cards? Maybe we need some kind of qualification. One that vows to be his follower or swear loyalty. So basically, we need to prove that we're on his side. We'll have to pretend. You sure move on quick. But what's this qualification thing about? Why don't we ask the guests on this ship? Great idea. That thought never crossed my mind. Asking around doesn't sound like a bad idea. The guests here are the cognitive versions of them in Shido's mind. They'll know any secrets he shared. True. You have a point. That said, the ruler here is that evil Shido. It wouldn't surprise me if they did turn hostile. Right. Yeah, wouldn't they attack us? We should prepare for the worst, of course. But I think we'll at least be able to talk to them. This ship is most likely an Ark loaded with those that Shido believes are worth keeping alive. It'd explain the luxury cruise ship. I doubt idiots who can't even hold a conversation would be here. We can at least gather information. It helps that everyone's wearing masks. We'll blend in even with our attire. He must believe that no one shows their true face to anyone else. Just like him. Well then, let's split up and ask around! Looks like everyone's taking off to go gather intel. There's no doubt I can sense the treasure behind this door. Looks like we already hit the jackpot. Let's go talk to the others. Huh? One of the VIPs used to belong to nobility? Yes, that must be why he can enter the sacred pal the sacred place. I heard he's not easily seen either. But why would someone of his stature always be by the poolside? Well, you must like it there for some reason, but I don't think it's the swimming. <laughs> hey. Beyond this door is the VIP area, and the main assembly hall is a sacred place. Looks like we can't get in unless Shido accepts us. My, even Mr. Uwe is a VIP? I just saw him at the restaurant to think an important politician like him has been invited here. Well, support from the political world should mean mental shutdowns are as viable as ever. <laughs> I'm quite envious. I wonder if there's a way I can get to know him better myself. <laughs> if you wish. <sighs> Hearing people speak so casually about the mental shutdowns business makes my head spin. But it seems as though we need cer certification from bi five VIPs to become a special customer. These people are willing to share anything. Perhaps it's because their faces are hidden? Quite possibly. Um, 
I'm not entirely sure how to speak to people here. I mean, I either remain silent or spoke in simple pleasantries during Bob's business relations. It's alright. You're some kind of sadist if you're making me get info from complete strangers, Joker. But I'll do it. I'm gonna avenge my mom. Yeah! Yeah, it's right over there. Nirvana S2. Nice. Hmm, so that is the president of a TV station? Indeed, Mr. Shida has quite the large circle of acquaintances. It seems you have to be at least that important to be considered a VIP. I'm truly envious. Why don't you go play the slots with him? That might get his attention. It appears these people all want to be accepted as one of Shida's special customers. By the way, we've gained some um, information on the VIP sh we should discuss later. Yes, we should. Oh, you have the elegance and refinement of Sorlak in the Ordinary Citizenry. My, such flattery. A high-class aura emanates from you as well. So you know this. <laughs> Most certainly. <laughs> hey, these guys totally ignore me when I try to talk to them. Do I look that much I like I don't got any money? Is it because of the skull mask or something? There's something I've noticed too. I actually saw what looked like a map on the way here. Why don't we go check it out? Alright. Just as I thought. Nice. We'll definitely be able to use this to our advantage. Let's take it with us. Whoa. We've got a good amount of info. We might want to regroup and go over all of it now. How did it all go for all of you? Not great, but not bad either. I was able to get a bit of intel as well. We should sort through all, what all of us gain for now. Well, I took a look at the map we obtained earlier and found what happens to a, what appears to be a safe room. Right here. Whoa. Oh, it's close. Perfect. Let's go over our, our intel there. Joker. We gotta head over to the safe room so we can, like, discuss and stuff. Yes. We literally said that's where we're headed. Still, this is a surprise. All the cognitive guests in this palace seem like real humans. The casino earlier looked pretty real, too. But talking with these guests was a whole nother story. You're that right. This ruler's observational skills and insight are off the charts. Shido's a formidable foe. Come on, no need to freak out. I'm not freaking out. I was just thinking it'll be easier to make a plan since they can talk normally. All right. Let's put together the information we gathered. So we gotta get a letter, uh, letter of introduction from the vibe... VIPs, and those letters become the key cards? You're right. Exactly. Now let's go over what all of us have learned. First, according to my intel, it's one of the VIPs is an influential po politician by the name of Uwe. He's supposedly seen at the restaurant at night and sits at a table near the window. Um, I'll go next. I heard about a prominent VIP who used to be nobility? They say he's usually by the pool. Please hear me out. Next is my intelligence. It seems the president of a TV s television station is also a VIP. He always plays slots at night. He would seem to he spends his money quite lavishly. Crap! I'm starting to forget people already. Hey, Next is my there? turn. For real? Even you got info? <laughs> of course, I eavesdropped. Supposedly, one of the VIPs is the president of an IT company. He's always in his room and reportedly enters from an exclusive hallway. Listen up. Well, then I'll close this out. How the hell are you? How the hell did you get info with your looks? It seems some guy they call the cleaner is another VIP. I've heard that he's cautious, so it's probably best if we check the other VIPs first. Um. Cleaner? Wonder what the, they mean by that. Wait a minute. I, after all the VIPs we listed, this one's a cleaner? Is he really a VIP? Hmm. Supposedly. Um, I'm sorry, I couldn't get any information. Me neither, so don't worry about it, okay? Let's just work harder during the battle. You're right, I'll do my best. Uh, but there's a bigger problem, you know? My memory's, uh, not so great. 
Anyways, who's who? Uh. Ah, it's no use. I can't keep the profiles of five people straight in my head. I can only remember about two of them. What about you, Joker? My memory is pristine. Really? Wow! We're up against five people. The politician Owe, a former noble, a TV station president, an IT company president, and a cleaner. We get certification from them and obtain letters of introduction that'll serve as key cards. But only go for the cleaner after the other four have been dealt with, right? Whoa, now that's impressive! You go, genius! If we can't remember the details on the VIPs, let's reconvene inside a safe room. Alright, let's get this done quickly. Hey! We know, we know how to get into the main assembly hall now. Should we head home? Huh? You want to go back already? There are people in here with special letters. That means Shido trusts them to a certain extent. It would be best to consider them as powerful individuals. We don't want. We do not want to get too hasty. Let us take our time here. Well, I guess we do have a little time to spare. Well then, let's head back for today. Yeah. Well, anyway, guys, gonna be a first episode here in the next episode. We are gonna, I think, begin our actual infiltration on the palace and get the key cards. And I'm planning to actually do this palace in one singular in-game day. So, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye!